2020 saw a tremendous um, racial justice movement um, occurring here in the United States. We went from being invisible minorities to being hyper visible minorities. And with that came a spike in anti-Asian hate and reckoning that the role of white supremacy in creating the U.S and all of its systems, including higher education, really had to be confronted. So APIA Scholars was founded in 2003 as a scholarship organization. Since then, over the last almost 20 years, we have really expanded our mission to not only provide scholarships to the Asian Pacific Islander community, but also wraparound services, such as mentoring and leadership skills training. When I hear the words racial justice, I think about the critical need to dismantle this model minority myth. This notion that all Asian American Pacific Islanders are smart, hardworking, obedient, because we know that there's actually tremendous diversity in the AAPI community. We submitted a proposal to the Kresge Foundation to really get a better sense, just a lay of the land of what was happening in the NHPI community. It is incredibly critical to not only disaggregate data, but then to really shine a spotlight on underserved subgroups like Native Hawaiian Pacific Islander students who are actually disproportionately not graduating from high school, not going on to college, and if they do make it into college, they're not persisting at the same rate. The NHPI population has too often been conflated with the Asian American population. And so this study was really a response to the need for research that could shed light on the demography of the population, their needs and challenges, and their experiences in higher education. We knew from that report that students who attended on APZ institutions from the NHPI community graduated at higher rates, and we understood that um, the supports that they must be offering um, were definitely making a difference in their ability to be successful. One of the most surprising findings is that there are more NHPI students enrolled in higher education in the continental U.S. than in institutions in Hawaii or the Pacific. This is really some important baseline information, and we hope that it's a point of departure to engage in more thorough and robust research and policy work to support the NHPI community. I think APIA Scholars plays a critical role in raising awareness about a population that's overlooked and underserved. They're providing a space for the API community to have a voice about issues that are relevant for them. I really do think that 2020 is going to be a turning point for many communities of color. This has been a trying year for sure for many different communities. As we think about moving forward in solving uh, issues of racial justice, I think one of the, the key issues is communities of color working together and really disrupting that paradigm of that there's not enough for everybody. And I think having a philosophy that working together um, we can accomplish more is really going to um, get us farther and, and have much more impact.